All right, well, we're just getting ready to head off to the Everglades and wouldn't you know it, the water pump goes out. So now I've got to replace the water pump. I went down and I grabbed a new one. Um, it doesn't look that difficult to remove and replace. There's only like three or four connections. So this should not be a problem, hopefully, um, but we'll see. So I got to get this water pump changed out, make sure everything is working before we take off. And um, we're going to go down to the Everglades. All right, we're all ready to go to the Everglades. Go check this place out. Wow. Oh yeah, the Everglades. I'm gonna go swimming with crocodiles. Okay. Everything looks good on the truck. There's the missus. See, Mr. and Mrs. just married. <laughs> we got married five months ago. You know, this is a, this is a great time of year to have airplanes flying over your head when you're trying to do a video. That's probably the best time of the year. No, this is a great time of the year to go down into the Everglades because it's so beautiful down there and the weather is just right. Cold at night, cold in the morning, and then just perfect throughout the day. All right, baby, you ready to go? Yes. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go to the Everglades and tonight we're gonna do, let me make sure this is on. Tonight we're gonna do um, we're gonna do um, the light and sweet. yes, right the light parade or the light uh, the zoo lights. Zoo lights. The zoo lights, yeah. And then tomorrow we're gonna do a little kayaking during the day. Go kayaking with the crocodilos. <laughs> <laughs> are they gators or crocodiles? Both. Both. They are together. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know which in, one it is. In Everglades, we're gonna find any kind of cocodrilos, alligators. I want to know if it's alligators or crocodiles. You'd think that living in Florida, we would know this. They call it the Florida Gators for a reason. Maybe that's what there is. Gators. They're gators. Yeah, they're gator gatorillos. <laughs> no. <laughs> and then let's see. So, and then the next night, the next day, we're gonna go on an airboat ride. Yes, that'll be a lot of fun. Yeah, that will go on the airboat road tomorrow. I don't know. I'm but just too excited. Let's All right, let's go, let's go. Figure one up. Let's go get our stamp. Passporte. For our passport? <laughs> yes, for our passport. Passaporte? Passaporte. <laughs>
was just a short little trip through the visitor center. It's a pretty small one, not too big. Um, but we really didn't have a lot of time because they were closing up right as we were getting there. But luckily we got our stamp. We got our stamp. Yes. Yes. Because <laughs> it's like 40 miles. We have to go another 40 miles to the campground. But this is like the visitor center. So we got to come back through here. All right, baby. Let's get back on the road. I know I'm gonna have to set up in the dark. Because of this one over here. Always. Hello. Hi, welcome. How y'all doing? Good, how are you? Awesome, thank you. Do you have your ID with you? I do. Thank you. Absolutely. We all camping? Yes, camping? we're going up to Flamingo. Oh, Flamingo, nice. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't realize it was right inside of the park. Yeah, well, it's at the end of the park. Yeah. <laughs> so it's 38 miles down the road. Uh, so it's going to take you about an hour to get there. Okay. Uh, but you'll be enjoying a nice sunset. Excellent. So it's like, I not love too it. bad. Uh, yeah, if you continue, it's 38 miles, like I said, but it'll almost take you an hour. Okay. So you just go straight. If you hit the water, you've gone too far. If I hit the water, uh, <laughs> then it's a boat. Hit the exactly. Oh, yeah, a boat on a trailer here. Yeah, sure. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, you guys have a great time. Thank you so Thank much. You. Bye. Take care. Bye. All right. There we go. America the Beautiful Pass right there. Very best because um, we're going to be right on the edge of the water of the Everglades. So. Yeah, this is this is gonna be super awesome. And we'll get to see the sunset. If I told you we can just run away, so come my darling, let me help you. We can follow the sun and leave the rain for somebody else that help themselves leave their trouble. And don't you worry, we're gonna find all we need in our sunset paradise. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. We're all set, now it's time to go into town. We're about an hour and a half from town. And I don't think either one of us realized. Oh, more mosquitoes coming in when I open the door. I don't think that either one of us realized that we were gonna be, what, 40 miles from the front of the park. Because this Flamingo Park is at the very end of when you go into the national park. So, um, so it's a, oh, there's a mosquito on the side of my camera now too. That's nice. Yeah, they're everywhere. This the mosquitoes here are so bad. So make sure if you ever come here, you bring your, your bug, bug spray. All right, baby. Are you ready to go? No. <laughs> All right, we're here at the airboat tour place. It's called Cooper Town. Because I got this on a Groupon, which is, is really good because it's uh, it was very, very inexpensive. Uh, like $20, $26? No, $20 for two people. I'd say that's worth it. What is the difference between cocodrilos and alligator? Do you know? I don't, but we're going to find out today. Because <laughs> okay. they're going to tell us. I know they are. That's just one of the things that they do.
Oh, that's the frog legs. Frog legs. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alligator. Mm-hmm. Alligator tail. Are you ready? Ready. Okay, what do you want to put on? Oh, you're in plane? Yeah, just you in plane. Okay, so that's the alligator. This tastes like chicken. Okay, now try the frog legs. Tastes like alligator. <laughs> tastes like alligator? Like softer? What is that? Frog legs. so bad <laughs> you're alive right now did you know that you're alive I'm alive <laughs> you're alive <laughs> so you're ready to go yes I am my heart was a lot of noodles nuts nuts noodles noodles like spaghetti, <laughs> like noodles. spaghetti noodles <laughs> all right so we're gonna we're gonna go um, kayak the Everglades. Okay. Yeah. Doesn't that sound crazy? Like kayaking the Everglades. Okay. I just told everybody that it's, it's alligators. No, that is not true. <laughs> it is too true. This, these are alligators. These are not crocodillos. Maybe. You, you, but we'll, we'll you find out. We'll, you, you can lie to the people. I'm not going to lie to the people. No, the people need to know. The people need to know. So these are alligators out here. Okay. I'm going to find out what the difference is between alligators and crocodillos. And then Let's we'll know for ask sure. for see if somebody knows what is the difference between crocodiles and alligators. There you go. We can ask these guys. These guys right here. Yeah. 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 <laughs> All right. Let's roll. We're rolling. Hey, truck's over here. The truck is over here. Ah. You, were, you were walking that way. Oh, okay. Well, I'm doing a video right now. Oh. Yeah, so. Here we go. Uh, what is this? Hello, new YouTube friends. We found your channel due to your tire cover. Oh, 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 look at this. This is so cool. It says, hello, new YouTube friends. Uh, we found your, ch uh, your channel due to your tire cover. You know the tire cover on the back? Isn't that so cool? What, who is that? Let me see the, let me see there. Brad and Diana, I know. Huh? I know. Brad and Diana? Follow along with us on YouTube. It's about time now. Okay. Wow, that is so cool. That is so cool. We got fellow YouTubers. Ha! All right, and away we go. Baby, are you excited? I am. <laughs> We're kayaking in the Everglades.
I'm not getting too close to him. I'm gonna respect his his area. Uh, let's not get stupid. <laughs> yeah. He's huge. All right, I had to do a quick video about this one because we are seeing sharks all over the place right here. We've seen at least uh, five, six, seven maybe, and um, they're just like all over, just, just cruising around right through this little channel here. Let me show you this. Absolutely amazing, absolutely amazing. This is like, we are so glad that we got up early to come out here because this is the perfect, perfect time. There's nobody out here and um, we get to see all the wildlife before everything gets scared away. So a little pro tip for you. Um, spend, like, when you go somewhere, the best time to get out uh, to see nature is when no one else has because y you wait and uh, <laughs> everything's gone by the time you get that's what happened to us yesterday now we got to see some pelicans and stuff like that but um, everything is gone by the time that you get out here because everybody scared everything away so get up early I know it sucks sometimes it does it sucks to get up early but uh, at least for me, anyway. I don't really like getting up early, but if you want to see all the action, you haven't got to do it. <laughs> this is so beautiful out here. I, I see at least a dozen of these little sharks. So I'm going to go back. Um, before we leave, I'm going to find out exactly what kind of sharks these are. They look like lemon sharks uh, because they have like a big, big uh round face but um they don't have they have like a, a really uh, a brown color and they have uh two dorsal fins so i think lemon sharks have two dorsal fins i don't remember now anyway we're just loving this right now come on baby <laughs> she is having a ball right now she's just having such a good time um, you can't help you know but not have a good time you're out here in nature you see just absolutely beautiful things um, it really gives you a sense of what's the word I'm looking for like gratitude gratefulness um, peace you get this this absolute sense of of connection because we are we're all connected in some way um i don't know how and i'm not going to try and tell you i'm not going to give you some philosophical understanding about how we're all connected in the universe i mean we are all energy that is that is for sure but how we're connected uh, i can't like tell you exactly Maybe there are people out there that can't, but uh, I'm not one of them. I just know that when I get out here, I feel I feel a sense of peace. I feel I don't feel like I understand anything any better. I just feel a sense of peace, like the, the serenity, just how quiet it is, knowing that all of these animals out here are trying to survive. That we are the humans. We're we're the only ones. Um, that can survive in most any condition. So, they can't. You know, these animals, if they don't have the right food supply or they don't have uh, the right temperature or, you know, there's more parasites in the water than, uh, than normal, whatever it is, 
they will not thrive. We as humans, we can thrive pretty much anywhere. Uh, <clears throat> we all have the ability, we just don't all have the skill. So. Escape is time.